up, what up? Jeff Joseph back with another video. Listen, you see the thumbnail, you see the title, so you already know what I'm about to talk about. But before I do, I wanna say shout out to you because we're almost at a thousand subscribers. So I definitely wanna say I appreciate all of y'all. Now I know what you're probably thinking, how am I just now getting to a thousand subscribers? And it's because they got about 2,600 people who constantly watch my videos, but don't subscribe to the channel. I know who each of you are and I'm going to find you. <laughs> no, but seriously, if you haven't already, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. It really does help me out a lot and I definitely, definitely appreciate it. But also wanna go ahead and shout out Ruby Christie. I know y'all see the merch, got some new merch, Gulf Coast shirts. If you're looking for some print for you services, make sure that you check out the description, the link in the description below. And uh, Ruby Christie got you on the print for you service. If you want some t-shirts, some hoodies, some hats, whatever you want, they got you. Um, also, uh, if you want some just positive t-shirts, positive vibes, they got you covered over there. And lastly, I want to shout out everybody except my dispatcher. Hold on one second, y'all. All right, y'all, I had to go find out about some parking real quick. I'm about to hit the gym and it's not really nowhere for, me to, nowhere for me to park, so I had to go find out some information. But like I was saying, I want to shout out everybody except my previous dispatcher. She went on vacation. My dispatcher went on vacation and never returned. She actually was doing not that great of a job before she went on vacation and she just went MIA. But I got a new dispatcher. Turns out I'm the best dispatcher out there. I've been dispatching myself and I've been making twice as much. All right, Chad, so uh, basically it turns out I'm the best dispatcher um, that there is out there. And um, like I said, I've been doing twice as much, about 40 to 45% more productive than what I was doing with my previous dispatcher. And y'all know, I've been talking about it in previous uh, videos, how important it is to have a great dispatcher. Um, turns out, if you just learn the game, you could be your own best dispatcher. Um, we've been doing you know, so much better, making so much more money without her dispatching myself plus you get to keep that money um you know that was going towards her gets to stay towards the company in addition to making more money than we were actually making so uh <laughs> so i would encourage anybody who uh, is looking for a dispatcher i know i get a lot of comments i get a lot of emails i mean well yeah i got a couple emails but i get a lot of dms about um information about my dispatcher now, i can give y'all my dispatcher now if y'all want um my previous dispatcher but i'm telling y'all now um <laughs> just learn the game for yourself and uh you'll be much much better off but i'm about 20 minutes away from my drop off and um it's not due to tomorrow so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go get me a quick workout in and um get fresh obviously um less time for content less time for you know taking care of this which i gotta take care of this but um, because I'm dispatching myself, I have less less time to, to make videos and things like that. So I'm gonna get into that probably in another video. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna talk about the load that I'm on. I'm gonna talk about the load that I just dropped off and I'm gonna talk about the game, the box truck game, um, when I come back from the gym. But in the meantime, y'all check out the B-roll. y'all so i just finished my workout i'm about to give me something to eat hopefully y'all can hear me i know the air conditioner is on i gotta run an air conditioner because it's hot as fuck where i am i'm in albuquerque new mexico um so basically i got a four thousand dollar load um that went from georgia to arizona and um i dropped that load off they wanted it there at a certain time i got it there picked up from there i picked up a load that was going to albuquerque uh new mexico which is the load that i'm on it's not due till tomorrow 
um, in about uh, 230 a mile with no deadhead and no dispatch fee, which is great. Um, but then I picked up another load, a partial. Uh, I picked up the partial that came from where I was to Tucson, Arizona. Dropped that load off. Now I still got this load that drops off tomorrow and then we start the new week on Monday. But I said all that to say, just to get to the point, I've seen some of these titles that people have been posting basically saying that the box truck industry is dead or trucking is dead or crisis mode. And maybe so, but I haven't been affected. I don't know what other people are doing, but I'm out here grinding every day and I'm getting loads every day. And like I said, I'm doing better now that I don't have a dispatcher, dispatcher myself. I don't know if, you know, I don't know what other people are doing, but I'm doing great. <laughs> Just say, you know, do your research. I would say also that, um, but also say that with the fuel prices have been pretty consistent, even though that gas prices are going up, diesel prices have pretty much been the same across the country, um, at least with the people that I get fuel with. Uh, which I have a pilot fuel car, pilot and fi flying J. The f diesel prices have been pretty much consistent across the board, which is uh, around like 530, between 539 and um, 560 has pretty much been um, the cash price, uh, not including the discount that we get. But yeah, I got a $4,000 load like it was nothing. And everything else I've been getting has been pretty much $1,000 a day, um, averaging over two, 20 to 30 a mile so um, I don't know what these other drivers are doing this is not meant to be a debate or an argument or anything of that sort I'm just trying to say that I haven't had any issues I haven't been seeing um, any any problems so I don't know y'all comment below those of you who are already in the game let me know what y'all got going on I've seen the most consistent work up and down the east coast and I know that the the Midwest is always jumping too. I haven't really been, I haven't even gotten that way yet. Um, like I said, I'm all the way over here in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And I really don't know what's gonna be next. Gotta stay tuned and see what loads I get next week where I end up. Um, but for right now, I've been moving and grooving. I've been busy, uh, what they say? What the ladies be saying, booked and busy. <laughs> um, I've been pumping and jumping, y'all. I've been moving and grooving. I've been getting loads, no problem. Like I said, I'm dispatching myself and I'm doing way better. And now that I'm dispatching myself, so now I'm advocating for everybody to dispatch yourself. Um, I don't know if that's because now, you know, my authority is over um, 90 days or, or what, but it's not that difficult. And I've been getting those left and right. I have been negotiating with brokers have actually been kind of fun because I've been treating them how they treat us and uh, putting them on blast. You know, I've been telling them, I've been telling them all kind of stuff. and. Uh, it works <laughs> so um, like I said I've been booking loads building relationships with these brokers and I'm making money so I would encourage all right my bad y'all had a phone call come through but so what am I saying all I'm trying to say is that I'm doing well um, I really have not ran into any issues I get consistent work and um, I'm making money so as always, make sure that you do your own due diligence, do your own research. Uh, always uh, drop a comment, let me know what y'all think, what y'all got going on. Again, um, you know, y'all getting consistent work or y'all getting consistent rates, is the fuel prices affecting y'all. Just let me know what's up because I can't be the only one out here still grinding and making money. And everybody else seems like, it, it seems like it's kind of rough on everybody else just from the titles that they post in. I don't know if it's just clickbait. I don't really have time to watch other people's videos anymore. But y'all let me know what y'all think. Drop a comment below and I'll holler at y'all in the next video.